Welcome back to my channel. I am super excited today because I tried to do this two scout for the first time. It didn't come up completely well, but I'm happy with how well I did. Considering that this is the first time that I'm actually not trained natural hair. Last time I did this was in primary school, and I think my mom used to do that for me. So yes, I just recently cut my hair. Actually, I think about five or four months ago. And so, oh, but I'm done. My hair is actually really good. My hair is just a showcase. So um, today I will be doing a smoky eye tutorial. I love myself with very good smoky eyes. Yes, so I'll be doing a tutorial on smoky eyes and then I'll be talking about my experience and time in the university. It's not a lot here, but I mean, there were ups and downs, good and bad, fun times. So I will just try and pick out the most memorable periods of my life in the university and just tell you guys about it. So I hope you enjoyed this video and if this is your first time, you are very welcome. So the first thing that I'm going to do is to conceal my eyes. So this is the um, concealer that I use. Sometimes I use um, a fairer shade of foundation. Sometimes I use concealer. Sometimes I use eyeshadow primer. But my favorite of all time is still this. So I'm just going to apply very little. Yeah, yeah. So my university life. Well, it was. It was good actually. I had a lot of really bad moments, a lot of depressing moments, and I had a lot of very, very, very happy moments. So um, I went to the University of Lagos actually, and I studied cell biology and genetics. And cell biology and genetics was actually so much fun for me, really. Starting with the friends that I made along the way, I made really wonderful friends. And really, I feel like your friends are like a huge part of your university life. If you don't have the right friends. I feel like your life is just going to be boring. Then my, I feel like my university life really started bubbling in 300 level. It was so much fun from 300 level to 400 level that I wish I could relieve those moments. Like no, just from 300 to 400 level, minus 100 and 200 level. Really. So I actually want to try to do the smoky eye without using the color black at all because I don't believe that your smoky eye always has the same feedback. So I'll be using this um, palette. And this is what it looks like on the inside. It's a really huge part. So, um, whenever I'm doing my smoky eyes, I don't usually like to start with the base. I like to use the darker colors and then gradually blend it out. So first I'm using this dark blue shade to start building up the color. And looking over here, I have my mirror here. So, I'm studying cell biology and genetics was like i said so much fun for me even though that was not what i wanted from the onset but i grew to learn it and love it so i think the first major challenge that i had in cell biology and genetics was in 200 level where we had to do french it was a compulsory course we had to do it in our first and second semester i had so much problem with it, I had to struggle with this because the only um, knowledge of French that I had was the old Jumapel and the tutu from primary school. So it was like, <laughs> I was like, how am I even supposed to do this? I don't even, I'm not usually good with learning new languages, but we had to do it. It was compulsory. And then I managed to pass it actually, and then luckily for me it was just two minutes, so I just freestyled it really. The exam was freestyled because it's not like I read and I understood what I was reading or anything, it was just prayers and freestyling then that same 200 level same 200 level in i can't remember maybe first or second semester we had to do chemistry organic chemistry oh god search two or three it was it was a big struggle and it was four units it was a four units course so it was it was do or die we had to go for tutorials, the classes were long and boring and pointless. It was, <laughs> I think that's like the worst examination I've ever written in my life. Really. I was really clueless and lost and I think for like the first time I was really scared for my results. But again, I was lucky, I passed it. That's one, that's one major cause in Faculty of Science that students feel a lot. Some people do it 200 level, 300 level, 400 level. I have extra air because of it. So I was just really happy that I did it once and that was it. So 
happened. Two hundred level was good actually. Apart from those two scenarios, it was okay. Although I was still kind of like a loner because I didn't have friends. I didn't really have friends, and I was not staying on campus, so I didn't get to mingle so much. Speaking of very difficult courses, another very <laughs> insane course that really gave me so much problem was um MIT 317 normally i don't know mathematics that's like my weakness i i don't usually do well when it comes to calculation math physics those are like my weaknesses really but you know i'm like sometimes you just have to really face your fears because trust me it's very scared of mathematics but then i just knew that i can't just keep saying i don't know this course so let me just leave it to lag behind so i just had to just do something about it and for the first time in my entire life i got a b in mathematics i was so excited because i was <laughs> can't even explain how happy i was when i saw that result and i got a b i was so proud of myself that i actually got a b in mathematics like i never thought like in a million years me me i would get a b in mathematics i never thought to happen so this is the first color that i used i think i'm liking it my I don't understand the shape of my eyes. It doesn't really make my eyeshadow pop. I think I have too much of skin here. So it's always just falling over. But well, this is what it should look like. Really. I think it would be better if my eyes were like this after. So next I'm going to go in with this darker shade of blue. Just like the sun light up the earth. It lights up my life. The only one I ever see with a smile so bright. Hey. And then I add, um, you know, not so much problem, but little problem with molecular biology. Molecular biology is like, I just, I think I found it quite difficult because it was too abstract. There were things that you had to imagine everything they were teaching you. There are no things that you can see pictures of or see presentations you just have to imagine that one ligand that one receptor they are communicating somehow so but the good thing is that all these courses i just usually find a way around them and all so enough about courses and actual school stuff so now what i'm doing is to blend using the same shade of dark blue that i used earlier just to blend in properly So basically, I'm just trying to just put it out there that your smoky eyes doesn't necessarily have to be black. You can use absolutely any color for your smoky eye. So I have to. I don't think this is smoky enough, so I want to do something to my under eye. Using this. I was also very lucky to have a good seminar and project supervisor. That is very rare to have those two combos good seminar supervisor and a good project supervisor so yes i was working on that part too i never had issues with results my results were always very correct i never had issues with broadsheets come to think of it i think my university was actually smooth so an extent was actually very smooth um what else trying to round everything up mm. so now i have managed to apply my lashes after so much struggle so the next thing now is to apply bronzer to my brow bone. The girl of my dreams. As easy as I can explain how to do um, a smoky eye. And then you can use any color of your choice. You can use absolutely any color you want. And you can decide to... So back to my university days. I, just, I think I'm just going to talk about my 400 level because I... I had so much fun, really. My Ankara day. I'm going to put up pictures of Queen, and I know. Oh, yes, I know. Mm -hmm. You are my African queen, and I know. See, I know. See, I know what I am feeling in my heart and in my soul. Oh, I know that it's this love. And I so, I really hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope it will be helpful. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and leave a comment. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you. Bye.